from the question, we can see that the wave speed v is equal to the square root of 2 pi gamma divided by lambda rho, where gamma, the coefficient of surface tension, and rho, the density of water, are constants. This means that lambda, the wavelength, is the only variable on the right-hand side of the equation. In other words, if we want the wave speed to change, the only thing we can change is the wavelength. This is clearer to see when you combine all the constants together. So you can write that k, a combination of all the constants, times 1 over the square root of lambda, is the wave speed. Using the wave speed at a particular wavelength, as given in the question, you can calculate k. You should now be able to find the wave speed at any given wavelength.